今天呢是比亚迪第五百万辆新能源汽车下线的日子。作为全球首家达成这一里程碑的车企呢，我们邀请你一同见证这个重要的事。Tesla may have sparked the EV revolution, but China's BYD just lit a wildfire. What if I told you the most disruptive force in the auto industry today isn't American or European, but Chinese, and it's coming faster than anyone expected? This isn't just competition; it's domination. BYD, build your dreams. Sounds like a slogan, right? But behind that name is a company that's rewriting the rule book of the auto industry. What started as a humble battery manufacturer in 1995 has now become the biggest threat to legacy automakers and even to Tesla. Why? Because BYD is not just building cars; they're building an ecosystem. Let's talk numbers. In 2023, BYD sold over three million new energy vehicles, not just hybrids, pure electric. That's more than Tesla, more than any legacy automaker dared to imagine. And the scariest part? They're just getting started. Here's what makes BYD different: vertical integration. While others rely on suppliers, BYD owns their entire supply chain. Batteries? They make them. Chips, in-house, EV motors, their own. Even semiconductors. This gives them the control and cost advantage that other automakers only dream of. Their Blade battery is a game changer. Safer, cheaper, and longer lasting than traditional lithium-ion cells. No thermal runaway. Higher energy density, and more environmentally friendly. It's not just a battery; it's a weapon in the EV war, and it's working. While most automakers struggle to make affordable EVs, BYD is already selling electric cars starting at just eleven thousand dollars in China, and these aren't low-quality boxes on wheels. These are smart, efficient, and stylish vehicles like the BYD Dolphin and Seagull, packed with tech, touchscreens, and intelligent driving features. Now BYD is expanding globally: Europe, Latin America, Australia, Southeast Asia, Africa, and they're just breaking into the Middle East and even Japan, a country famous for defending its domestic auto market like a fortress. But BYD isn't knocking; they're kicking the doors open. Even more shocking. BYD doesn't just make passenger cars; they dominate electric buses and trucks. They're powering city transit systems in over 50 countries. And while Western automakers spend billions trying to catch up, BYD is already years ahead. And guess who noticed? Warren Buffett. His firm Berkshire Hathaway bought a major stake in BYD back in 2008. That wasn't luck; that was foresight. Today, even as Buffett trims his holdings, BYD's fundamentals have never been stronger. This isn't just an EV company; it's a tech company that builds vehicles, and that distinction matters. They're building EVs the way Apple builds iPhones: tightly integrated, optimized for scale, and relentlessly efficient. BYD isn't here to compete; they're here to lead. And while American and European car makers are still debating timelines and lobbying for EV subsidies, BYD is executing, city by city, country by country, quietly, relentlessly. Legacy automakers laughed at BYD a decade ago. Now they're watching their market share evaporate. In China, Volkswagen sales are declining. Ford and GM are shrinking. Meanwhile, BYD is surging ahead. It's not about making better EVs anymore. It's about surviving in BYD's world. At the heart of BYD's success is its revolutionary blade battery. Unlike traditional lithium-ion batteries, the blade battery is constructed using lithium-iron phosphate. LFP, known for its stability and safety, in rigorous tests, including the nail penetration test, a standard that simulates severe accidents, the blade battery has proven to be fire resistant and thermally stable. This innovation not only enhances safety, but also increases energy density, leading to longer driving ranges and improved vehicle performance. BYD's ambitions extend far beyond China's borders. The company has established a significant presence in Europe, with a new European center in Hungary focusing on sales, after-sales support, and vehicle testing. In South America, BYD is setting up a factory in Brazil, aiming to produce up to 150,000 electric vehicles annually by 2026. These strategic moves underscore BYD's commitment to becoming a global leader in the electric vehicle market. One of BYD's most significant advantages lies in its vertical integration. Unlike many automakers that rely on external suppliers, BYD controls nearly every aspect of its production, from battery manufacturing to vehicle assembly. 
This approach not only reduces costs, but also ensures quality control and supply chain resilience. By producing its own semiconductors, electric motors, and batteries, BYD has created a self-sustaining ecosystem that many competitors can only BYD, short for Build Your Dreams, began as a humble battery manufacturer in 1995. Fast forward to today, and BYD has evolved into the world's largest producer of electric vehicles. In 2023 alone, BYD delivered over 3 million new energy vehicles, surpassing Tesla in total EV sales. This meteoric rise isn't by chance. It's the result of strategic innovation, aggressive expansion, and a relentless pursuit of excellence. While many associate electric vehicles with passenger cars, BYD has also made significant strides in the commercial sector. The company is a global leader in electric buses, with its vehicles operating in over 50 countries. This dominance in the commercial vehicle market not only diversifies BYD's portfolio, but also positions it as a key player in the broader transportation ecosystem. The rise of BYD presents a formidable challenge to traditional automakers. Companies like Ford, General Motors, and Volkswagen, which once dominated the global automotive industry, are now grappling with the rapid shift towards electrification. While these legacy brands are investing heavily in electric vehicles, they face significant hurdles in terms of technology, supply chain adaptation, and market acceptance. BYD's head start and aggressive strategy put immense pressure on these established players. Looking ahead, BYD's trajectory appears unstoppable. With continuous innovation, strategic global expansion, and a comprehensive product lineup, the company is well positioned to lead the electric vehicle revolution. As governments worldwide implement stricter emissions regulations and consumers increasingly demand sustainable transportation options, BYD's forward-thinking approach ensures its place at the forefront of the automotive industry. In the rapidly evolving world of electric vehicles, BYD isn't just keeping pace, they're setting the pace. With their commitment to innovation, safety, and global expansion, BYD is not merely participating in the industry transformation, they're driving it. The question isn't whether BYD will reshape the automotive landscape, it's how profoundly they will do so. The future of transportation is here, and it carries the BYD badge by 2030. Over 60% of all cars sold globally will be electric. BYD is already building the factories, the batteries, the infrastructure, and the logistics to own that market. They aren't just thinking cars, they're thinking cities, charging, storage, transit, smart grids. BYD is a blueprint for what a 21st century mobility company should look like. This is more than a company. It's a signal of where the future is headed. Faster, cleaner, cheaper, and yes, Chinese. Of course, BYD isn't invincible. They face global regulatory hurdles, trade tensions, intellectual property scrutiny, and in crowded markets like Europe, brand recognition takes time. Some critics question their quality, others warn of subsidies or government favoritism. But here's the thing, BYD keeps winning because their fundamentals are sound. Their margins are improving, their quality is rising, and their pace is unmatched. In 2008, Warren Buffett's Berkshire Hathaway invested $230 million in BYD. At the time, it seemed bizarre. An American titan backing a Chinese battery company? But Buffett saw something most didn't. Execution. Today, that stake is worth billions, even after recent sell-offs. Buffett once said, you don't bet against a company with a 10-year head start. And BYD? They have 10 years, plus a blueprint. Others are still trying to copy.